Hey Shig, welcome back to Nisi Girl Tarot. We are here to do the peek into June readings for all signs, okay? I started with Gemini because it's Gemini season, okay? But I'm also going to finish up the rest of the air signs. So we are on Libra here, okay? We are peeking into June. One thing I would to you know suggest to you guys is for you to go back and check the readings um, that have already occurred. For example, like Go back to the first half of May and see if that reading actually resonates now that you've actually experienced the first half of May, right? Gotta kind of see, you know, like stamp if like things are, you know, coming out as they say they're going to come out. But things are like, you know, see if it resonates now, okay? So this is for Libra. For the month of June, we're peeking into the month of June. We want to do the overall energy and like the three major energies that you will be dealing with here in the month of June. Okay, and then I'll do advice from spirit because we always want to get advice from spirit. That's what tarot is all about. Okay, it's about guidance. Okay, guidance for us. All right, so Libra. These are the decks that I'm using. Okay, and I want to announce it. All right. <laughs> okay. So Libra, your overall energy is disappointment. Oh no discontent and boredom okay that's like four of cups energy so you probably just like uh let the quarantine be over this is getting on my nerves <laughs> type energy um but you're just like not happy with the way things are right now okay so that's your overall energy here in the month of june um you also get authority okay um that's like the emperor okay the authority energy Right, Aries energy. You also get hope, okay? So that's like the star energy. Okay, that's a major arcana. And then you get triumph, okay? Which is also a major arcana. Which one does this represent? I'm going to find out. Alright, and then your advice from spirit is financial and material through material financial and material changes okay that's your advice from spirit so some of the things that you um may have been worried about look movement choices and decisions right behind that okay some of the things that you may have been worried about are actually coming together here all right I'm going to clarify Libra's reading for the month of June. I'm going to pull the cards the same way that I did with the other deck. No, I didn't. I'm not going to do that. I changed my mind. All right, clarifying for Libra here in the month of June. All right, clarify authority here. So someone's going to take charge here in the month of June um, on a new beginning in love here with the Ace of Cups. Um, they're going to take charge in starting or initiating that. Okay, They're going to be the King of Pentacles and take control of the situation. All right, The Emperor and the King of Pentacles are like aligned. So like the King of Pentacles is like the lower, lower, the minor arcana of the Emperor. Okay. Um, someone someone has been tapping into their intuition here. So they're like making an executive decision, okay, to um, like start this Ace of Cups, okay, this new um, opportunity in love, okay? Because someone moved away from rough waters to go to calmer waters, okay? Someone used their intuition and made a change, you know, took that emperor power. And decided that they were going to make some things happen. All right. Hope is clarified by the three of swords because there has been some heartbreak. Okay. So someone is making an executive an executive decision because there has been heartbreak here. Okay. There has definitely been heartbreak. All right. And the Nine of Cups, I don't read reversals, but it did come out upside down reverse. So it's just saying, like, there has been heart some heartache. You have not been happy, okay? You haven't been happy. All right? And so, like, the things that you have been wishing for, the, um, the because right now with the discontent and 
boredom card as your overall energy there are some things that you just have not been happy about okay it's i mean page of cups just try to come out again so let's clarify the triumph card here for libra in the month of june what is this triumph card here and i'm going to look up and see like what card that represents in the major arcana like what is card number seven in the major arcana it's in my book <laughs> i just can't remember what is triumph what is this triumph here for libra what is Libra triumphing? Triumph. What is triumph here for Libra in the month of June? Mm. You get justice and the Empress, okay? I call the Empress like my baby mama card, but, you know. <laughs> the Empress is also um, abundant, okay? She's fertile she's um nurturing she can produce okay like she's the major arcana queen of pentacles okay she's good she's solid all right the justice being here is also saying kind of it's what it's kind of saying like like triumphing or making or making a decision on something like things actually coming into your favor like you getting your justice okay you getting you in the Empress power, you getting, yeah, because remember, this is like the Emperor right here. So it's like, yeah, things come into a line. Look, the Queen of Pentacles came out. Things come into a line. Then you got the King of Pentacles and the Queen of Pentacles here. All right, what is this financial and material changes here is the advice in June for Libra? What is this financial and material changes here? We'll leave her here in the month of June as advice from spirits. Yeah, financial and material changes because with the Five of Wands and the Five of Pentacles, it's like there has been constant change or constant. Um, inconsistency right um not having enough not um being content things is always being up in the air right that energy is going away here in a month of june okay look the four of cups clarifying the four of cups <laughs> discontent and boredom you just not happy with the way things have been and so that's what your focus is here in the month of june changing the way things have been things made the way things have been in love the way things have been in finances the way things have been in your happiness like those changes are happening here in the month of june for you Libra. it's like someone's taking control they're making the executive decision <laughs> to change this energy all right so, I hope this helped Jim, uh, Libra. <laughs> I hope this helped Libra. Um, this is looking good. Things happening. Um, pick into June. We're all halfway through 2020 already. This is craziness. All right? Um, and you guys take care. I'll see you soon. I miss you guys already. Bye-bye. <laughs>